the vlog. I look so summery. I feel like I'm on holiday. So me and Matty are in Glasgow. We are here for the weekend because Matty's getting a tattoo. So we have just got to the room. I've just got ready. We're away to meet um, Carly and Jake for lunch. And then we have got dinner tonight. We're kind of in a rush. We're meant to be at lunch in like 10 minutes. back from lunch we went to hillhead book club it was so cute i didn't really film any of the outside or anything but it was so nice and then we went for a walk around like botanic gardens and um ashton lane and all that which was so cute then we went to wait rose our first ever wait rose i'll do a haul we got two cookies and then brownie bites millionaire shortcake and coke so we're going to Spontini tonight. Glasgow's still in level three, so can't drink inside or anything. I also have like an hour to get ready. So I think I'm just gonna have to top up my makeup and take off the red lip. So I went to go get ready for dinner. And then I think we're just gonna come back to the hotel and have like drinks in the room. I'm not sure, it's a really nice night. So I might go back out, um, but yeah. So, um, vlogging in public but Spontini said that they don't take the kids so they told us to come back at half seven so we're exploring oh. also I cannot explain how warm it is there's no breeze I'm roasted mm -hmm. and um fancy car spotting since we're in the west end it's really nice yeah so hopefully we get a table at half seven or we'll starve to death, basically. So we're just home. We had to swap rooms because our aircon was broken and honestly, how hot was it? It was at 27 degrees. Twi boiling. Well, so we didn't want to complain. We had to anything. move, we had to pack everything up and, and my stuff was everywhere. So we're in our new room. This one's actually a bit nicer than our it's other room bit. because we have a wee coffee machine. It seems bigger. Yeah, it does seem bigger. Oh yeah, Matty was annoyed because the TV was like nah, <laughs> over there the in the last there. room and you couldn't see it from the bedroom. So I couldn't really vlog like much today because honestly, what a dessert, like faff, what a faff. Spontini basically didn't have our booking and we also turned up at the wrong Spontini. Because of you. you and me for that. No, it was my fault. Um, and then we phoned the Spontini that we did book at and they were like, no idea what you're talking about. So, long story short, we managed to get in. And then food was amazing. Like, oh, so fine. We've been to the one in the city centre, like in, um, just off of Pecanon Street last time we came to Glasgow and it was so nice. But we're on the one, went to the one in West, West End, Bayers Road. Road. So, and it was so nice as well. And we're outside, so we got a wee cocktail as well. And we walked all the way up to Loop and Scoop. I don't know if I've seen it on in, everywhere on Instagram, so I had to go. Karma with her. Um, so I had to go. Waited about half an hour in the queue, but we were determined. Got there, and they were like, "It's like another twenty-minute wait for Tudos." So we just got ice cream, but honestly, so fine. Like. Best Ferrero Rocher ice cream I've ever had. Now we're just waiting to chill. Matty's tattoo is tomorrow, so we're gonna get a breakfast. Matty's gonna go to his tattoo, and then I'm got a whole day of my own. The essentials. <laughs> this is before. Now. Saturday morning. I look a bit tired. I am a bit tired. It's like half ten. I slept in way later than I wanted to, but I'm on holiday, it's fine. So Matt is away to go get his tattoo. I'm so I have all day to just 
do whatever I want. Yeah, so I'm gonna get, up, get ready and then I'm gonna do some fun activities. I'm gonna go shopping. I'm gonna just have like a me day, a nice relaxing me day. Okay, so I haven't actually moved. I was too busy. I don't know what I was doing actually. My friend Ala just reminded me, I did have a reminder on my phone because I did check the other day being like, must be soon. It's officially one whole year on YouTube. Oh my God. I honestly, the day I posted my first video, I edited it for about four days straight. I took out every like slight second of non movement or speech or anything like i took it out i watched it over like five times i sent it to matty to for him to like check it over even when i posted it i re-watched it and i was like oh my god i can't believe people are actually gonna have to watch this I didn't eat that whole day i didn't tell my family it's a bit like when you do a talk at school and you feel sick about it the whole day and then once you do it you're like well that was fucking easy like that's what it was like anyway I am actually away to go get ready now because my day is running away from me. Oh, I just came so to brush my teeth and Matt has left my toothbrush out with toothpaste. That is so cute. Okay, I'm ready. I look a lot better than I did in the last clip. Yeah, just need to actually leave now. This is what I'm wearing. I'll see if I can show you in the other mirror. Okay, so this little dress, my little trainers, this who, this jumper, I feel like everyone in the world owns this jumper, but it's so soft. And then this little bag, I wore this bag yesterday, but how cute is that? I oh. also have this little bag for tonight. How fucking cute is that? Like, I, they're both by the same brand. Um, I got the money sauce, but how cute. Although I don't have anyone to take a photo of me today, so I'm gonna have to wear this outfit again tomorrow so I can get a pic. So the plan is I'm gonna get on the subway. I'm gonna go to the West End. Yesterday was the first time me and Matty had ever been to the West End of Glasgow. I don't know why we've not been before. I'm gonna go to Juicy. I don't know if anyone's seen that place on Instagram, but I've seen it everywhere. An acai bowl. And then I'm gonna go to the Botanic Gardens and eat it. And then I'm gonna shop him. So who knows? Who knows what might happen? Um, but yeah, I will hopefully vlog most of it. And yeah. <laughs> do some vintage shopping and charity shopping I think as well. shattered so i went to a few vintage shops in the west end i went to i went to one called like duds or something i also went to the charity shops on buyers road because a few people said like they're really good never got anything in the charity shops i did get something in the in the duds shop then i went to another like really cute little vintage shop i just like stumbled across it so i went in and um it really reminds me of the vintage shop in aberdeen like just off of George Street. I went there in my first charity shopping video. And then I walked up to 
West Vintage and then Retro Vintage and they're both like towards like Calvin Grove so I walked all the way up to Calvin Grove then I was absolutely starving like you know when you're starting to get in a bad mood my feet were sore I was like I need a seat so I've never been like out for lunch myself but I went to Subway and I got like a toastie and wedges and you know what it hit the spot I'm still starving but it hit the spot and then I walked to the Calvin Grove subway station and came back here. By the way, West Vintage is so cool. I could have bought so much in that shop if you like that kind of stuff. But I just thought I would dump the bags and have a snack because I bought some of these. And I also bought them. I went into Waitrose and I bought a can of water just because I can. And I'm going to walk to Buchanan Street and go to like Zara, Urban Outfitters all of that and then I think I'm gonna get me my some donuts for when he comes back from his tattoo I'm gonna tidy up a bit I've had such a good day myself you know who needs to be away with anyone since Mike's ditched me I'm going to enjoy my crisps and I'll be back Pulsing, can't. I actually can't. So I'm back home, back to the hotel. I it's now quarter to six. I just came back from like Buchanan Street. I did a lot of damage in Urban Outfitters and in Victoria's Secret. But yeah, my feet honestly feel like it's so weird. Like my shoes aren't un well, they obviously are uncomfy, but like. They, they don't rub but it just feels like i've been walking on like planks of wood all day like my tattoo's still not done he says he thinks it'll be done at like by like six so hopefully he'll be soon i did buy him some donuts so when he gets back to the room he's got a nice treat now we never booked anywhere for tea tonight because we didn't know what time my tattoo was gonna be finished and plan is hopefully I was gonna go and pick up a Pisano pizza so we could take it back to the room. However, I genuinely cannot walk to Pisano. Like, it's it's like a five minute walk from here, but like, my feet are killing me. So I might see if Matty will walk. That is so bad of me, like I, it is. But so hopefully Matty will walk to Pisano for a pizza. And then we've booked the hotel bar at eight yeah because i have a really nice outfit to wear tonight so we'll still be going out at least we don't actually need to like leave the hotel because i can't you know what? i actually can't be bothered leaving the hotel i was gonna do a little haul but i think i might do a separate video because i bought some other stuff like online so i think i might do a, a like a big haul I haven't done a haul in ages so oh god to reveal not yet Ooh, it's actually bigger than I thought. I'd be thick, so I can't roll it. <laughs> oh my god, it's so nice. It's really good. Are you happy with it? Yeah, I love it. Oh my god, it's I love huge. It. How weird, you got a tattoo on your leg now. I know, it feels quite weird. It's yeah, it's really swollen. Is it hot? hot? Is it hot yet? Feel it. Oh my god, it's burning. Can I have a bit? Oh my god. Oh my Christ. So, milk and cookies. Holy crap. Peanut butter and jam. Millionaire shortbread and glaze, vanilla bean glaze. That's what you'd be wanting. So, my just picked up a Pisano. Mine looks really weird. I don't, I don't know what's happening to. I'll wait, eat this while I get ready. Yeah. Mm. So, we're in the bar. It's very quiet. I didn't have time to vlog. I'll show you my outfit when we get back. It's nice stuff. It was a hundred percent there. Matt is certain he's seen Olivia Neal in Pisano. It was outside Earlier, Pisano. Earlier, I don't know why she is she being glass. Honestly, it was a thousand percent there. 
anyone knows. You're just raging because you never got them. If anyone knows, <laughs> if anyone knows if Olivia Neal was in Glasgow on um, Saturday the fifth of June, please let me know. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Good morning! So it's now Sunday. I'm wearing the same clothes as yesterday so I can get a photo. We're away to uh. leave. to leave and we're gonna go to Coco House and hopefully get some fluffy pancakes and iced lattes and then can we go home? So yeah, hopefully a way to get some breakfast. Be <laughs> <laughs> that is disgusting. How cute! How cute is this water? Nice, got a good eggs. When in Glasgow. So basically, we are in Edinburgh. I had to get on the train to Edinburgh because there's fucking strikes uh, on a Sunday. So we are now waiting an hour and a half till the Aberdeen train, hopefully. And I've still not had a chance to eat my pancakes. I'm starving. They have been slightly destroyed and I don't know how they're going to taste five billion hours later, but we'll see. I'm not going to lie, they're unreal. It's your verdict. Matty is annoyed he didn't get his one. They are really fine though. As Matty, Matty just said, they like melt in your mouth and they actually do. Like, oh, we got the Biscoff ones. Well, I got the Biscoff ones. Yeah. Delish. Waiting for our train. So we are on the train home. I have just sat and edited the video now i'm so tired it's half past four we're meant to get home at two so i love that yeah we had a very good weekend did yeah, we man. uh if you enjoyed and i will see you in my next video bye, bye.